So yeah, there's the blue sky, so I guess everything's fixed again. So, those mad souls dove straight into the ocean over there, did they? Yep. Uh, all, all I could see from here was the whale, Master Chai. T'was surely Alphno and those friends of his. They did something heroic, mark my words. You need only look up there for proof of that. As you say, my love. They're sure to be back any moment now. Any moment. They are coming back. Of course! <laughs> there, there, dear. Everything will be all right. There! There! Look! Over there! Over the beach! Is that me? Title logo designer and image illustrator Yashita Yashitaka Amano. Yep, it's me. Where's, where's, where are the others? Where's Hardbird? Ho there! What up? Greetings! You all right? <laughs> Welcome back! <laughs> ah, Sulkin. The main man himself. There they are. I didn't think we'd be swimming the whole way back. <laughs> Heavens. <laughs> Heavens. Take me. Alpha no. Oh hells. Oh hells. <laughs> up sooner or later okay they seem to be common <laughs> water and out oh what up fail hello and thus did salvation come to the first did it though The lamps of Amarot will fade along with Emmet Selk's enchantments, and the depths shall be as once they were. <laughs> <I'll spend laughs> okay. So Mount Gulg will one day fall, and the Talos below yield to wind and rain. For now, you can enjoy the blue skies and night skies. This tale, too, will fade with time, passing into legend as the world heals and moves on. Sad about this loon, though. <laughs> Alpha. <laughs> Nevertheless. What? Nevertheless what? So we're back in the Crystarium. What up, gang? A 
as ether obeys the cycle, as death and decay gives way to new life. Oh, there's Artbert. Is it really him or just some sort of imagination we're conjuring up? There they are. So too do the memories we share inspire others to rise to greatness. For we who walk before may lead those who walk after. Your road goes ever on, as does your story, as does your legacy. Such ah. is the hero's lot, to touch the lives of countless others. Excuse me, you're the warrior of darkness, aren't you? No. Who are you? Where are you from, really? And how did you get to be so strong? <laughs> Push-ups, pull-ups, and plenty of juice. <laughs> Let's, let's, let's. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, I like this. So that is Final Fantasy XIV Shadowbringers Update 5.0. Hell yeah. There they are. Who's this? So we have Tancred, Yustola, Alfino, Alice, Orianje, Reem, and is this supposed to be me? Yeah, he does look like the Dark Knight in the trailer, so. Yeah, I should have. I should have been a Dark Knight doing this expansion, but. Eh. Anyway, can we skip this? Yep. Yeah, I'll just listen to the music on YouTube, but damn, I love this music. Hell yeah! Ah. <sighs> what? Shadowbringers is not finished yet? What? Okay, let's continue on. Let's speak to the Crystal Exarch. So I guess this would be the preparation for the post Shadowbringers content, you know, 5.1, 5.2, 5.3, and currently we are in 5.4. Hello. By your deeds has the blinding light been banished from these skies, and the Sin Eaters driven to retreat. Although our many hurts will be years in the mending, I have faith that this world and her people will one day be whole once more. Well, at least you now have a number for the mending. With no rejoining in prospect, the Source need no longer fear the coming of an eighth umbral calamity. Yeah, but Garlemald can still do calamity things, so... Can we... can they go home now, or what? And with that triumph, the future from which you came will no longer come to pass. Yet here you still stand. So, yeah, what the hell is gonna happen to your previous timeline? So I do. I wonder if that other age continues onward somehow, cut adrift oh, there, from yeah. time's flow. Or have I simply etched myself a place upon this new block of history? I don't know. Either way, this is an unexpected development. How so? As the summoner of your souls, my death was meant to release you back to your world. Oh, <laughs> and since you're still alive, they can yet go I home. Yet I'm very much alive, and you are still stuck here in the first. Hmm. 
Right. I believe I speak for us all when I say that we are happy to postpone our return if it means your life is spared. We will seek out another way. Is there another way? Yeah, I think there is, but how long will it take you to find it? Besides, I never had any intention of rushing home. There are people here I still need to thank, and this means I might actually have time to do so. Yet we dare not neglect our comrades in the source. Yeah, we still have a war there. Mistress Tataru, to name but one, will be most anxious to know how things stand with us. But I can go back and forth, so... So, you'll just have to make the journey alone for the moment. Be sure and give a full report to our fellow Scions, will you? Oh, and we'd also appreciate any news you can bring us from back home. <laughs> Then I see no reason to delay. I can open the path from here. I imagine we each have matters demanding our attention, so let this be a farewell for us all. Send word when you've resummoned our friend. Oh, and do try to ensure he arrives within the city next time. <laughs> of course. I shall strive for utmost accuracy. No strange forests or unplanned passengers, I promise. <laughs> All right. What up, Reen? I'm a little relieved, to be honest. I would have been terribly lonely if everyone had suddenly disappeared. Can you go with us to the source? Yeah, that's what I'd like to know. But I understand that you have to go. Safe journey, warrior of darkness. I hope to see you again soon. Just a moment while I attune the portal. Okay. When I was a boy, many long years ago. Is that Ardberg talking? I yearned to stand tall as the heroes of Eld. Or is it Gratia? But like a fool seeking to pluck the stars from the heavens, my every attempt to reprise their deeds fell short. And then one day, an all but forgotten dream from my youth stood before me in the flesh. I'm the hero. Would that it was so easy. The glory of the heavens was ever beyond the grasp of those who never thought to reach for it. But if I have gained anything from all of this, it is the courage to stretch out my hand. Do you hear me, Grahatia? This is no time for sleeping. What? Or is he talking to himself? You know, like a pep talk of some kind? That was confusing. In the Imperial Palace in the Source. So I'm pretty sure Elidibus 
felt that Emmet Salk has fallen. So we have Gaius and Estinian here. Gate. I want to know what's happening there. Same as the others, struck down with a single blow. An unfortunate day to draw guard duty. Forgive me. These were your people. We took advantage of this slaughter to slip into the palace. It is not for me to grieve them. So... Oh, okay. That was the Emperor! Wait! Ugh. Is Xenos... on a rampage here? What the hell? You've missed your part in this, I'm afraid. So it's not Xenos. Identify yourself, demon! You were hoping for the Asian? Oh, is it Xenos already? The Craven shed this skin and fled, rather than face me. A pity. I was looking forward to crossing blades with myself. Whoa. But I cannot deny the feeling of satisfaction. Body and soul reunited at last. You still have that artificial echo? What was that called? I forgot. What now? The game continues, but the pieces have changed. in a paragon's words. A mistake I do not intend to repeat. Uh, what? He speaks the truth. Elidibus is gone. Tore a hole into the rift. <sighs> Xenos. My foolish, greedy son. Was a second life not enough? Was the Empire too rich a prize to ignore? Okay, so the Emperor is still strong. Your freedom for our nation, our people, will never be won by a spoiled princeling. The burden of this throne is beyond you. Damn. Does Xenos care, though? He only wants to hunt. Hmm. Tis you, father, who have struggled with this burden. Simply holding the Empire together has occupied your limited faculties. But you may take comfort in knowing that I have no intention of pursuing your teeth. There, agenda. see? He just wants to hunt. Nor am I interested in ruling over the Empire's lands. I came only to remove that which ruins my sport. I will not have my prey stolen Whoa. by your petty wars and cowardly weapons. So did Xenos stop the, I guess, production and usage of Black Rose? You would kill me just for that. 
What? I need no other reason. Any and all who interfere with my hunt will not do so twice. So he killed the Emperor, so... I heard the Asians speak of Zodiac, an Eidolon. Even the will of this star is but a construct of our own making. Damn, he lost his mind. <laughs> we Jesus. shall gorge upon their strength, and then, my friend, our contest shall begin anew. The hell happened to you? Whoa. Is he a match for Xenos, though? So we're back. So we can head back to the... to the tower, to the Rising Stones, but I need to check something. Gotta go back to Yulmor. Or do I need to talk to Tataru to finish the... to actually finish the MSQ? We'll see. Alright, we're back in the Rising Stone, so apparently I still need to do this. But we'll see. What up, Tataru? Yeah, it's been a while. Hello. What? <laughs> what up? <laughs> From your pixie fair, yeah, all right. Ah, so yeah, because I, I I've been using Feo Ool whenever I summon my retainers in the uh, Norvent. But I, th I kind of forgot that she also talked to Tataru. So, yeah, alright. The Garlean armies have been slow to react. Alright. We did call in an old friend. Estinian? Kral and I had a terrible time tracking him down, though it will be worth it to see the look on your face when you find out who it is. Ah. <laughs> you have to tell me. Yeah, alright. Wind up Grahatea. <laughs> oh man. So there's Elidibus. Oblivion has claimed, yep. I think he's sensing Emmet Selk's no longer with us. Oh, all right. Okay. He told Xenos the truth. Truth. What a poor jest that tale has become. The flow of history has become muddy. It's currents wild beyond my capacity to direct them. Alright. You have wrested the advantage, Heidelin. The thieving hands of your disciples tightened their grip on our star. The origins of the world remain hidden and its inhabitants ignorant of their broken existence, just as you and your creators desire. Alright. 
He likes to hang out in the moon. Though your champion has indeed proven to the most egregious obstacle to our ascendance, a barbed thorn in my side, he may yet be removed and cast into the abyss. Oh, okay. So I guess it's uh, Elidibus's turn to go crazy in the first. What? But I'm the warrior of light. What the hell? What's this? Oh, Thancred and Reen. What's up? Right about what? Something out there. Even were we to restrict ourselves to brief forays, I don't like to imagine the effect it would have on our ether. Okay. <laughs> it's really nice to see Tancred warming up to Reen. <laughs> Let's head back and prepare for this mad journey of yours. So who's watching? Where are they? What's this? The hell is that? Though blazing skies give way to gentle night, what hand can end the war of dark and light? That's deep. You have completed the main scenario quest, Shadowbringers. Alright. Bolstered by your experiences in the first, you are now able to accept new quests from job related NPCs in the source. Level 80, relevant level 70 job quest. Oh. Quest locations and other deal can be viewed. Okay. In addition, quests to unlock new content have now become available in the Crystarium. For two worlds await your adventure? What? She can resolve, so... Now I'm gonna check back in Yulmor. Let's see. Oh, I think we can now. Alright! <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Okay, we can now buy level 80 equipment. Uh, what's this? What? Crystarium gear exchange, what? Perdurable tombstones, what the hell is that? So this is for allegory. Okay. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, we've been wearing... It's not much of a change, but... What does it look like? Let's see. Nope, uh, let's see the armor. Nope. All right. What's this? Uh, deep Shadow Solvent. What the hell is that? This is 470. Cool. Oh, this is 500. All right. 
And this one, Crypt Lurker Gear is... 520! Oh! Cool! Now what's this? Yeah, I don't get this. I'm looking for someone. Hmm. Come on, come on. Oh. What? This is a level 7. What? Huh. Yeah, I double check. I think this is the one. This is the quest that will open the main reason why I played Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, we'll see next time. So, yeah, we're done with the uh, Shadowbringers, and man, I loved the events that happened here. The music, the ambiance, the plot, oh man. Oh, I wonder, is Artbert still here, there, everywhere? Hopefully he's still present here. And hopefully he gets the chance to talk to the rest of the Scions. Because as I mentioned, he has surpassed Harshafont as the big bro of the game. Well, as far as I'm concerned. But anyway, we'll continue on with this. I'm not sure if... I'll continue to record the succeeding content. Yeah, you know, update 5.1, 5.2, 5.3, 5.4, but we'll see. But this one, this one we will definitely, definitely record and enjoy together. So if you enjoyed this series of videos, we had the main scenario quest, we had a dungeon run and a trial, two trials, I think. Anyway, so yeah, that's it for Shadowbringers Update 5.0. So hit that like button, and if you wish to be updated on my uploads, hit subscribe and the notification bell. And you can also follow me on social media, links will be in the description down below. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.